That's exactly right. If you don't like the look of Tom's forecast, you're not going to like the sound of this. Frigid temperatures are going to be here to stay for quite some time. And with temperatures this cold, we got to get ready for this now. Oh, we really do. Yes, we've got two warm days that we can, you know, get our things done, get them in order. Because in the last 41 years, 41 years, we've only had a cold stretch like this for two times, 1983 and in 2021, which is what you're seeing behind me. Clearly, there was more snow on the ground during 2021. But when we say it's going to be cold and that we need to get prepared, we really mean it. Before the storm, prepare your pipes. Cover any exposed pipes with insulation or protective covering. You'll also want to locate your main water shutoff in case a pipe does freeze and burst. We're pushing it, but if you've not scheduled an HVAC tune-up, you may want to go ahead and call and get on their list because I have a feeling they will be very busy for the rest of January. Drain water from any outdoor water lines and cover outdoor water spigots. Also, it's a good idea to get an emergency kit together in case electricity were to go off, flashlights, candles, and batteries, they could be helpful. Now, during the Arctic blast, we want to keep your thermostat around 68 degrees and it helps to set it on a permanent hold. Keep a drip on both hot and cold water. You wanna pull from both of those water sources hot and cold. Open cabinets to allow warmer air to get to the pipes and then shut off rooms that you won't be using, diverting heat to other parts of the house. Now, most people want to know when will we snap out of this cold spell and I can tell you that I'm really not seeing any 40 degree temperatures throughout the month of January. So my best advice, enjoy today, enjoy tomorrow because it's not going to last long. Jesse.